Hello, I'm Paul Zimmy Finn, and this is The Generation Report. Like all Americans, I was shocked and am saddened by the murder of George Floyd in Minneapolis last week. This is a great country, but we all know we have more than our share of terrible problems, as this put in sharp focus once again. In searching for a way to express my thoughts about what has transpired since, I thought of many of the people whose ideas not only strengthened my belief in the cyclical nature of history, but who also illuminated for me what changes could be on the horizon. In that vein, I want to leave you with a few brief but poignant excerpts from the Overture to Jordan Peterson's 12 Rules for Life. We must each adopt as much responsibility as possible for individual life, society, and the world. We must each tell the truth and repair what is in disrepair and break down and recreate what is old and outdated. It is in this manner that we can and must reduce the suffering that poisons the world. It's asking a lot, but the alternative, the horror of authoritarian belief, the chaos of the collapsed state, is clearly worse. We're pack animals, beasts of burden. Order can become excessive and that's not good, but chaos can swamp us so we drown. We need to stay on the straight and narrow path, the dividing line between order and chaos. Perhaps, if we lived properly, we could withstand the desire for vengeance and destruction. Perhaps we wouldn't have to turn to totalitarian certainty to shield ourselves from the knowledge of our own insufficiency and ignorance. Perhaps we could come to avoid those pathways to hell. And we have seen just how real hell can be. Please tune in to the next episode, Space Flight and the Fourth Turning. Thank you for listening. Stay safe. And may God bless America.